Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Phantom Strategies. Uh, I want to talk about Tron in this video. It's been a while since I have mentioned Tron and covered Tron in this video. So let's talk about it. Uh, so Tron right now is trading around two cents. It have been in this channel for, I'm looking at the weekly chart by the way, and uh, it's been trading in this sideway pattern for like, you know, almost a month now. Uh, we had this nice upward channel that I mentioned back in like, you know, uh, November and December time frame where uh, we hit the rock bottom right around one cents and then we have we were in this night uptick the volume was st starting to pick up and overall market was looking uh, somewhat okay but then you know um, uh, Tron was really picking up and we um, we had this creation of this inverse head and shoulder um, so when I talk about inverse head and shoulder um, reverse inverse head and shoulder um, I have mentioned that in uh, um, a Litecoin as well before if you remember I talked about uh, in the daily chart in the Litecoin where, he, where we had this inverse head and shoulder pattern which we broke out and now we are sitting right around $60 in Litecoin so Tron on the weekly on the weekly chart on the uh, Tron um, we are seeing the same inverse head and shoulder pattern right now left shoulder right here uh, then the bottom that we made around uh, one cents in uh, November December time frame and now uh, at the formation of the right shoulder so um, so what is the uh, you know the breakout of this so the longer we go in this sideway action the stronger the breakout it will be alright so typically what happened when we have a squeeze in the price action a sideway pattern for a long period of time uh, when the mark when the uh, the price point when it snaps it usually have a very like drastic move uh, whether it's on the upside or the downside but it usually have a very drastic move um, the reason I'm looking at Tron right now is I, I feel like there is some move um, uh, that should be coming uh, when the market is uh, trying to get its legs back and trying to like move in the upward direction so I feel like uh, there is a move coming up in Tron also there is a it, there's a resistance the nine day uh, moving average resistance that we are about to clear in Tron we haven't really cleared that we are sitting right on that this blue line we plenty of time we came right on that um, and we uh, came right back so if we can get over that uh, moving average then I feel like we can have some momentum on Tron and if, if we can get uh, look at the volume uh, that can pick up um, so for Tron to like you know if we can have that move um, it will happen pretty uh, pretty fast uh, uh, so Tron when it starts moving it moves pretty fast so uh, do keep an eye on this coin and I think the next target you know um, based on looking at this price point the next target for Tron is going to be around three cents uh, that's going to be the neckline for Tron so again this is the formation of inverse head and shoulder right now now it's not a inverse head and shoulder pattern until we you know break the neckline the neckline again is going to be around three cents okay neckline in Tron is again it's gonna be around three cents if it breaks out of that in the long term it is it have very good potential but until even the neckline that's almost like a 70 percent move so let's say if we are doing if we are taking the long position from the current price point of uh, 0 0.023 okay and we are taking the target from here to the neckline alright um, let me delete this Uh, where is it? Okay, so let's take we're taking the long position and we are reaching even the neckline, which is around that three cents mark. That's around thirty percent move from here. All right, so that's a very drastic move. Um, so keep that those things in mind, and it it will happen. This kind of thirty percent move that I'm talking about, it happens really. Uh, pretty fast uh, especially in the smaller coins like Tron alright so um, if you are taking a position or if you already have a position then you know um, just keep an eye on this coin because I feel the movement uh, in Tron is gonna come fairly soon um, and there is a support level of the 20-day moving average uh, on the weekly so keep an eye uh, on that as a support uh, for the uh, on the downside alright uh, again this is a speculative coin um, so 
don't go with uh, you know large position like 50 60 percent of your portfolio position into this kind of coins because this coin tend to be very speculative and uh, when they move it looks really nice and rosy but when they go on the downside it, the pain is also not as uh, it's, it's a painful to see your portfolio take a hit um, uh, with a 50 percent position in this kind of coin so uh, so do keep in mind it's really subjective things there's very personal thing uh, from a trader to trader how how much risk you're willing to take how much risk tolerance you have some people are okay with only taking five percent of position in speculative coins like that some people are okay with uh, taking 20 percent position in coins like this so it's really up to you uh, your um, uh, your trading pad uh, like you know uh, uh, trading uh, uh, personality and like what kind of like risk tolerance you have right so those things are very uh, individual um, but again just to recap uh, Tron uh, the sideway action is going on for a while and it's ready to snap um, when this kind of sideway action snaps it, it tend to be very aggressive either on the upside or downside also keep an eye on the volume that will be a good confirmation if we can sustain a um, you know long-term breakout all right so that's all guys let me know if you have any questions and i will start covering some more uh, coins uh, in coming days uh, market have been quite flat for last week or so so it didn't have any much things to talk about i mean it's just completely flat market so um but i i see some there's some momentum going on right now it's monday morning uh, april 1st so let's see hopefully we can get some momentum in the crypto market all right talk to you soon